that is really high. Me mining here. I'm rock hounding in Quebec at a mine that also has some radioactives. So I thought I'd try out something that was just sent to me. I haven't played with it a lot, but we're gonna do our first little test. This is a Geiger counter. Comes with his own little case. Awfully handy as a rock hound. There's the manual in multiple languages. Here's the unit. Pretty simple instructions and uh, a charging cord, USB charger. Let's turn it on. Here is the background radiation at my home, 0 0.07. In some places, as low as 0 0.04. Oh, there we go. <laughs> this rock here is one of the radioactives. It's alanite. The identifier is, it's in layers. And then of course the sheen. There's a nice little crystal there, an appetite. There's a little larger one right there. And background radiation. It's 0.27. I've been in a few mines that I've seen like a yellow cake come off the walls. And I wondered how radioactive is this area or where my dogs are drinking water. So it's a pretty handy device to have. Okay, we're at the mine. And I don't think this is exactly where they were mining the uh, radioactives. There's part of the trench down here. Let's go into the trench itself. Look at that, 0 0.31, 0 0.35, 0 0.5, 0.54. Holy smokers. 0 0.62, 0 0.62. These rocks are hot. No. Oh. Guess that explains why some of these rocks are so black. They're burned by radiation. I'll try another spot. Okay, we're in a different part of the trench. Let's see, it runs up there. 0 0.31, 0 0.27. It does jump around a bit. 0 0.31 again. Let's go deeper here. Put it on a flat surface, take a look. 0 0.23. Interesting. Seems pretty consistent. But, but, but look at this. Holy smokers. It is. That is really high. It's an alarm. Well, not an area you want to spend too much time at. Okay, well now it's down to, that's interesting. So it was just back here on the road, the hall road. In main menu, you can adjust some of the features in this device. I haven't even done date time in the clock yet. A couple of others that are of interest to me is you could schedule how often there is a test and the duration of that test. It stores up to a hundred records. The records can be deleted in part or in whole using the delete feature but once you exceed 100 the oldest record gets overwritten the alarm is interesting because that sets a threshold for when the unit will start to beep this geiger counter is not water resistant so i suggest sealing it in a plastic bag if it's raining
Here are a few of the rocks I collected. I will put in the description where you can buy a similar unit. And I thank you so much for watching. We'll do it again real soon. Bye for now.